Like everybody was on that floor saying me. So me and my supervisor got into it. <laughs> welcome back to my channel for today's video what the fuck did i just do <laughs> for yes i'm gonna be vlogging today i know y'all miss the vlogs and i miss them too personally i like vlogs more but sometimes you know you gotta switch it up a little bit so but yeah we back at it with the vlogs it's quarantine still but some stuff is still open like they just opened our mall and stuff like that but I'm not going to the mall. I just need to run a couple errands. This pops a thunderstorm today, so I gotta get to it. And I just text my eyebrow girl. Um, it's been a minute since I got my eyebrows done, girl. Love. It's so frustrating because when I do my eyebrows for like my makeup and stuff, like I just can't, I just can't get jiggy with it. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, but it's about to thunderstorm, so I'm about to go to the store because I need some stuff, and I've been craving an acai bowl. Like I don't know why, but acai bowls are really like I'm really craving them, and I blame Evan. Evan is the girl that has the Sims page that I follow, and she's a hairstylist too. But she be making stuff on her Instagram. But anyway, so I'm about to go to Whole Foods, and I gotta run a couple. Erin, so hey y'all, we back at it with the vlogs, and yeah, so, but first, of course, the first thing I need to do before anything, before I is, bitch, you already know where we going. Oh, this is gonna fall. It doesn't help that it's around the corner from my house. Ugh, the police station over there, like, what are you doing? You wanna be in a video? But it's been a minute since I talked to y'all about like life and stuff like that. Um, because life has obviously been on pause. And that's why I've really been like, I don't know. i just been wanting to do different type of content instead of like my vlogs. Because I know y'all love the vlogs. I personally like vlogs more too. But um, yeah. And y'all like, when is we finna get a long vlog? Like we need another story time. And I'm doing another story time like some recent shit i know y'all don't give a fuck about old shit but i mean old shit is cool but y'all want to hear the spicy shit but i'm just waiting to get this blonde wig on just so i can be real cute like literally every everything is always a line like i don't know what the fuck like this coronavirus but everything has always all these lines have been so long like everything is just long like what the fuck but my skin is so good i just love it <sighs> but yeah you got some nerve pulling up next to me no honestly <laughs> since this line is long i guess we can i guess i can rant to y'all so obviously um i'm in a rental car right now if some of y'all do may or may not know that i do not have a car i haven't had a car for months like since like december yeah i'm in the process of getting a new car i've been looking and now i'm now that outside is kind of opening back up but the banks are like you know um getting back into whatever i'm trying to find an accountant right now just so i can um start that process and then also y'all keep asking me am i still getting my body done because i'm still because i'm working out still in um quarantine yes girl i'm still getting my body done i'm still going to get my hips i don't care um but my doctor he already is back in office like girls are starting he started back in may 11 um because miami i think miami um restrictions are up so but yeah i'm still going but my appointment changed to august and i'm still moving to atlanta i'm still moving like everything was just on pause so 
y'all keep DMing me and asking me. Yes, it's gonna be a whole video, a whole process, and I can't wait. It's gonna be June, July, August. Damn. So I'm gonna work out this whole month just to get my body together. Cause I, I still wanna be healthy. I still wanna be, you know, I still want my body to be able to recover and bounce back because girl. And um yeah, so and also y'all i don't know why but every time okay so like i like now that i'm my skin is getting clear and now i'm starting to like my make my like i'm starting to not not like makeup but i don't like wearing it like when i have to put it on it's just like uh like but i like getting cute but i think i need to find a new routine because I feel like my, like if I put on too much makeup, I be looking so, I feel like I look so different. Like I look different and I want to look the same, like I want to look still like clean and sophisticated and like a baddie. But I think it, it might be my lashes or something. <laughs> I don't know. This is just my personal thoughts about myself. And I'm just like, what? Like, I want to look more, I want to look dewy and like, I don't know how I'm trying to de describe this. But yeah, sometimes if somebody wears too much makeup, it can enhance their features so much. But I don't know. If you get what I'm saying, comment down, down below because yeah damn this line long as hell and it's gonna be a thunderstorm and shit oh my god y'all it's been raining here like crazy like it ain't even been no opportunity for me to like take cute pictures outside that's why sometimes i lack on instagram about posting and stuff because it's just raining here and sometimes i don't like taking pictures of my house just because like I just don't until I move my house ain't gonna be um aesthetically pleasing as I want to so that's why I don't really take pictures in the house like that and that's why I take mostly outfit pictures I told myself I would never dig this shit I I know if I'm like boosting this music I know they're gonna be like this black fucking ghetto bitch what what you have to say Y'all, it's so gloomy today. Like, uh, it's just so irritating. But tomorrow is gonna be way better because, girl, we finna go get some tacos. It's these tacos I've been wanting to try for the longest, like, and they sell them heavy in California. But somebody tagged um this place um on Facebook, and I barely be on Facebook, y'all. And I think it was my cousin. Hold on, y'all. I gotta order my coffee finally. Um, Ice matcha green tea latte. Sorry. Um, and then add almond milk and toffee nut with sweet cream. Almond milk, toffee nut, and sweet cream. And then can you make sure it's light ice in there, please? You betcha. What else? So these are the tacos. Like you get to dip them in like this sauce, and I've been wanting to dry them so bad. Uh, I just want to dip it. Y'all, I'm half Mexican, so the Mexican, I love spicy food. Like, I love all that shit. Damn, that shit took forever. That shit felt like forever being in fucking Starbucks. Morning. This is what I meant to tell y'all. I for totally forgot because, obviously, Starbucks mine distracted me. But, oh my God, y'all. So, I remember what I was about to tell y'all. So, let me tell y'all so the other day right i go to work some of y'all know that i still work at the hospital and do youtube but i work at the hospital 4 to 8 a.m 4 a.m to 8 a.m four hours so okay there's covid patients obviously but we were informed that we us phlebotomists aren't going to be going into positive rooms right so i guess they rechanged the rule as as stuff is reopening now back up now the rules are changing now i guess we can go we can go in the positive rooms like they're allowing the phlebotomists to go in these rooms and i'm still like mm -hmm, whatever so girl why did they <laughs> they tried to send me on the floor they tried to send me on 
All the patients, I had 19 draws for the day. All the patients were positive. So, okay, so I'm like, mm -hmm, y'all better not talk to me for the rest of today. Like, y'all gonna be big. Y'all, I be wanting to quit so bad. But I'm really only sticking through it because it's insurance. I really don't need the job. It's just for insurance that I need insurance just in case something happened to me, you know. And I'm about to get my money done, so I really want that insurance. <clears throat> so, anyway. So, they set me on the floor. And, you know, I'm going in the room, whatever. Because they said that you can wear a regular mask and wear goggles and you'll be fine. That's what our supervisor is telling us, right? So, girl, I get to the floor and I'm going into rooms and stuff in aerosol, airborne rooms. I can't go in because you need like an N95. And the N95 mask is more like, that's like nothing is getting through that mask to get to your mouth or like in your nose. So, and I can't fit that mask. My face is flat. Like, I don't have a bridge on my nose for that mask to sit on my face. And like, even with these masks that I have right now, like it be drooping and stuff, my nose, like I have a flat bridge on my nose, so I fail. And they know that. So, um, I get on the floor and the nurse, she like, you're going in these rooms with no N95? And I was like, well, that's what my supervisor told me that we don't need it. She's like, no, you need it. Like, she's like, you need an N95 mask and you need to wear a regular mask on top of it and you need to be wearing a shield like no and i was like oh homegirl let me let you call my supervisor right now on the phone let me let you tell her like everybody was on that floor saying me so me and my supervisor got into it i was like um i don't feel comfortable she was like well quality control says you can wear a regular mask and you'll be fine no these patients these doctors and nurses is saying that i need the n95 mask sweetie and you're telling me that i'm behind and they actually work on this floor no i was like you can come and do it if you want to but i'm not doing it i don't fit that mask and that's noted so if you want to come do it that's fine but i'm not doing it so <laughs> give me my and i gladly gave her my pack and I gladly got off that floor because like that's just saying you don't give a fuck about me and my well-being like you don't give a fuck you don't care like um it's okay no it's not okay so like these people just uh these supervisors just don't give a fuck they don't give a damn and I'm just like no I'm not going in there sorry so yeah y'all like I've been really up with my vitamin C and stuff too with my elderberries. That's what I need to get to some more elderberries while I'm at the store. Cause girl. Yeah, that's that's what I had to tell y'all. So they really try to play me. They really try to have me affected with COVID. <gasps> oh, who the fuck is that? If you wanna check a daddy, it's like a um Lamborghini. Goodwill open, what? What? Shit is open, y'all. Shit is open, open. Hobby Lobby? What? That is crazy. But coronavirus is still out here. Like, I don't know why people just acting like this shit is just, like, whatever now. Because, girl, I don't know. I really don't understand. I got it pretty like a girl And he got five stories to tell See both sides like the girl See on both sides like the girl From my life to the school part He didn't like I'm underworld Had my tattoos and she Y'all, so I just came out of Dollar Tree because I'm going to show y'all what I'm doing today. I'm trying to do this little experiment. But, okay, so there's a discovery right next door. Right? So I'm like... Hmm, I'm literally always thinking of videos, y'all. So I'm like, what if I did like a discovery, like, I don't know, like a haul, but like, or maybe styling discovery outfits. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section or how you feel about that. I don't know. I haven't been in discovery in years. So, cause you know, that was the little rule 21 
um forever 21 starter kit okay but yeah let me know y'all Okay, y'all, so I just got from the store. Y'all, if I have kids, they gonna love me. You know how your mama always left to go to the grocery store and was out all day? Girl, I left at one, it's like six o'clock. So, but anyway, so I'm gonna do Whole Foods first. I went to Whole Foods Target and I went to Dollar General cause I'm about to do this like experiment. Well, it's not really an experiment. It's like a DUI hack for like, you know, those in, um, in the ceiling lights. I'm gonna show y'all, y'all see but anyway so this is what i got from whole foods i wanted to try this gluten-free chia plus i think it has chickpeas in it because y'all i Ew, love breakfast food you didn't even eat the last one those was protein did you like it no exactly that's why i'm experimenting on what i want oh you got experiment money yes okay. and you know i got experiment money you clearly see my bank account See, don't do that. God don't like that. What? Don't get over I, your I head. Do. Fast you get it, God. I know. Um, you keep I know. So yeah, I've been experimenting on like healthy waffles. So I ended up getting protein waffles. That shit was nasty. So I'm gonna see what these are about. And then I got my yogurt that I like, vanilla coconut milk by So Delicious Dairy Free. Then I just got some pineapples to keep my homegirl right. And then I got some acai powder. Like I told y'all, I wanted to make an acai bowl tonight for dinner, so that's what I'm gonna have. Then I got elderberry shots for my wellness. Cause I told y'all they, they wanna see a homegirl go down. And I told y'all they trying to send me to the COVID floor and I wasn't going for it, so gotta be up on this and then i got my almond milk creamer for my coffee best one some kombucha health aid best ones i'm trying out a new one this cayenne cleanse we'll see what that one is about but my favorite one is the pink lady apple it's fire i'm gonna try this box water a lot of people i mean i've seen a lot of people posting it and i'm gonna try it so i got my favorite chips this is the best chips ever like, you really don't. Late July sea salt pepper. So good from Whole Foods. I just got some eggs. Y'all, this is my favorite water. Like, nothing beats this one. The Aquapanna. This one is so good, y'all. It's so crisp. Mm, I'm gonna have one right now. Okay, y'all. Y'all know I got a sweet tooth. So, I, these are my favorite cookies. Right now, this plant based, girl. Plant based chocolate chip cookies. Girl, I can eat these in a day, but we not gonna do that today. Then I just got some more bananas, strawberries. So I haven't had pasta in a long time, y'all. So I got this chickpea gluten-free shells to see what these are about. So we gonna see. Then the last thing I got from Whole Foods is these gummies, woman formula, like everyday gummies. Gummies is easier for me to take. So I just got them in gummies. Y'all, yeah, I really don't like big pills. It lit I literally had to YouTube how to swallow pills when I was younger. Girl, I put that a pill on the back of my throat and drink water. That's how I drink pills. I can't just plop it in there and drink it. I just can't. So I just got I gummies. I just can't. I just it's can't. Easier. It's easier for gummies. Mm -hmm. Target, they need to get um they some inventory because they don't have nothing. So I just got these um, pads so I can do my toner. Girl, they definitely had Lysol to go. So I put these in my purse, so I just got a few. They had a whole bucket. I was gonna be petty and take the whole bucket, but I just got four, you know, to keep in storage just in case. I just got some elderberry gummies cause mm -hmm. we need those, girl. Hey y'all, so Dollar General. Y'all, Dollar General is the plug. If Whenever I move, when I go to my new house, I'm definitely getting my um, plates, bowls, cups, and stuff from the dollar store. Like, don't sleep on the Dollar Tree. Everything's a dollar. I just got a few of these cups because I drink tea in the morning. So I just got like these black mugs. And then I also got this, I only got one of these, this cute little mug to put my coffee in because I need to portion control my coffee. Like I said, I don't drink it that much. I drink matcha. But when I do drink it, I think I should not do that much. Because if I get a big cup, I'm gonna get some more 
more coffee. So this one is cute, and then put my little straw in it. Cute, it's cute. Yeah, it's cute. See, don't don't sleep on Dollar General, y'all. And then, okay, so I went to the first Dollar General, and they didn't have these ones, so I had to go to like you know a bougie one. And they ended up having the lights with the circle on top of it. This is what I'm gonna try in my bedroom to, you know, create a vibe for the um in the ceiling lights. And then I just got batteries and then also I just got these containers to keep my bananas in because I like to drink banana smoothies with almond milk. So I'm gonna put the, the bananas in this in the freezer. So the first Dollar General I went to, the, they didn't have the circle ones, so I ended up getting these square ones. But I'm probably gonna use the circle ones first. It's the same. The light is not light. <sighs> breathe through it, girl. Breathe through it. So, anyways, I'm about to put my groceries up, and yeah, girl. And then we're gonna get into this experiment because I really wanna see. really wanna see how. <laughs> I really wanna see how it turns out. So, yeah, girl. And it's. Like raining outside, oh so ugly. But anyway, it's If some of y'all have this problem when you're taking off those um, stickers at the bottom of stuff, Goo Gone is your girl for it. Cause you know how like when you're trying to get it off, it leaves that white sticker adhesive behind like that. So you don't want that obviously. Just pour a little bit on there. And see how easy that is. See y'all, comes right off. You can get this from anywhere, Menards, Walmart. So yeah, get you some adhesive remover. It's just good to have first up like this around the house, so yeah. Oh, and today I uploaded my laptop case um, on Instagram and it's from Sheet Geeks, y'all. This website right here. So yeah, it's super cute. It just came in the mail yesterday. It's because I, I needed a new laptop case because I don't know. I just really wanted a cute one but sophisticated and sleek. And I found this one on Chic Geek. It's super cute and it's hard. And it really snaps really good because the last one I had didn't snap that good. But this one hasn't been coming off at all. I only had it for a day but still. It's very good quality and it was expensive too. For a laptop case, a hundred dollars, but I guess. Oh my god, that is so cute, y'all. So I think I'm just gonna go around along my ledge, well, my wall or whatever, and put all four over there. That is too cute. That's a vibe, okay? Put all four. It's gonna look so cute. Oh my. If that's not a vibe, I don't know what is. That's so cute. And it was only $4. Well, with the batteries, it's like eight. But yeah, that's so cute. Oh my God. So, yeah, cause I, when I turn my lamp on or whatever, I just get like dim light and that yellow light. And I would rather have an LED light than anything, so. And it's pretty bright, like what? So, but anyways, y'all, I'm just about to chill for like a second 
and i'll probably i'll probably update y'all what i'm about to eat tonight or when i start to make the acai bowl so yeah y'all y'all my room is so cute in here hold on let me turn the brightness down it's so freaking cute wait girl it's so cute and it was only four dollars so but yeah and then the other ones that i got um i just put them behind this mirror so it just lights up i'm about to keep them on anyway because i'm about to do my skincare routine so i don't gotta turn no other lights on because i just got out the shower and i'm about to sit here and do my nighttime skincare routine okay so i just got done doing my mm, nighttime skincare routine i'm gonna do a whole video on it don't worry but i ain't showing you the tea now okay so i'm about to do my jishua tool i posted this on my story yesterday and this company actually reached out to me but i did get this through sephora they reached out to me to send me some product i'm like girl i need the whole pink line because i really wanted the pink one but all they had left was the purple one so this is my jishua this tool is just supposed to be like a facelifter and it like d um puffs your face and like you know enhances your features and like enhances like jawline puffiness and stuff like that so this one i'm about to do and that's i haven't been consistent with it yet because i literally just got it um and i didn't get it with my sephora stuff but i got it after that because i really wanted to try it out because like i said before in this vlog y'all i have really strong features but my jawline um I want to enhance it i don't want to enhance like too much but i want to naturally like enhance it without the botox or whatever the fuck so and then i ordered um that moon cosmetics um face oil to go with it girl that face oil is taking forever to come it's the one that's all been all over instagram so that she sold out a million dollars and like 20 minutes or something like that congrats to her or nine minutes i think so i've seen a lot of people talking about it so i wanted to try it you know just to have like a face oil to put on at night but for now i've been using um bio oil at night that's how i got rid of most of my acne scars so yeah so i'm just gonna put a little bit and i don't put moisturizer on at night i just put a oil on Oh, I'm just gonna put this on and then I always clean this with a wet wipe after it so it's good for the next day and I put it back in here but yeah so I'm just gonna swoop and there's videos on YouTube on how to do this but I'm just gonna do this side of my face first you can put it in the fridge too I know people use those J rollers and put them in the fridge but I just don't it's already cold though it will probably be colder but yeah, I just go up like this to get all that. Um, it's kind of like, what is that called? Lymphatic, like a lymphatic massage for your face, basically. I miss my taco pudding. This is how you smile when you listen. And I'm competition. It's gonna be right here so hopefully that smooths it out <laughs> so we'll see <laughs>
clean it with a wet one and put it back in its case so it's good for tomorrow clean yeah so i'm gonna try and be consistent with this and see if it makes a difference so yeah i'll definitely keep y'all updated for now it is so when my hair isn't well when i don't have a wig on or nothing like that i like to um oil my um scalp at night and then also i'm consistently all wearing a bonnet because at night because you know i'm trying to you know get my hair back and it's been working so um yeah my hair is getting i use my herbal growth oil if y'all have seen my hair bald treatment routine um you have seen that i use this growth oil it's from uh sunny in then buy i think that's how you say it but yeah girl this product her whole line is the truth that's what got my bald head my bald spot back and my hair growing this growth oil so good and then what's been bouncing my curls back i'm gonna show y'all in another video y'all are gonna be shook because it's so good but anyway so i'm about to comb up my hair but yeah i like to oil my um put oil in it in the morning like right after i get out the shower and then at night right when i'm sitting down chilling doing my nighttime stuff because also i have this um scalp massager game changer it feels so good and this is what i'm always excited about to do because y'all i'm just a sucker for like anything massaging my head like i just oh my god i just love it but anyway i got this from the beauty supply store so You probably do, but I don't. So, <laughs> mm, it feels so good right here in the middle. Oh, in your kitchen. Oh my God. Also, shout out to Divine Beauty Lux. She sent me this bonnet, so thank you, boo. I just love pink bonnets. And then that's it. That is what I like to do at night um a lot. Do after, right after I do my skincare, I do my hair. And then cuz you know all the oils, I want to keep touching the oils. And then yeah. Yeah, let me go wash my hands real quick. The Pixie Glow Mist, I put this on at night. It has um argan oil in it and something else but yeah I just spray this on and this is my last step to my skincare routine like morning and night so she's glowy as fuck so um my face is red as hell but um something there's a hack that i don't know if i ever showed y'all or not but i've been really wanting to watch waist deep and this is how i watch all my movies if i'm in a mood to um you know watch a particular movie but i can't find it um i mean like it's not on netflix or nothing so this is what you do you go to google and then you put one two three movies waist deep and then i always been doing this y'all i've been going to all the movie websites like all the time and this one should work i think i've been on this website before oh hell no it's a fucking trailer okay so this one should work move but i don't like all these stupid ass pop-ups coming up that shit irritating but they normally stop after a while but in the beginning of 
you click in um it does that but this one should work okay yeah it worked <laughs> so yeah y'all oh shit oh shit oh shit come on make it full screen bitch we live yep it worked okay <laughs> pause ho so yeah so yeah y'all that's like a little hack that i've been doing ever since for like a minute um like literally a long time now um my camera's about to die but yeah um and i never get cable or nothing like that so in my old apartment i would literally look up movies on my ipad and plug it in to my it was like a little adapter thing that you buy from the apple store you plug it in hook it up to your tv boom you got a whole movie movie night okay so don't ever say i didn't put y'all on nothing so anyways i'm about to go to sleep watch this movie i'll probably talk to you in the morning it's sunday today's saturday i'm probably wake up do my workout and we're gonna get it cracking get our tacos i'm so excited but a yeah, girl so i'll talk to y'all in the morning Happy Sunday. So I'm about to cook my tacos and I just got dressed. And this is what I have on. These pants are from Pretty Little Thing. My the rep for Pretty Little Thing sent these to me. They're pretty big. I think they're plus size. But um, yeah, because I seen this girl with this, but this wasn't a part of the list you could choose from. But I was like, girl, can I please have it? She's like, yeah, girl, I got you. Tape or whatever. Well, when I take my pick sunglasses on for today i think they are so cute for my pig and i got these from slay blue she sent them to me in a p.o box i'll put her um instagram right here on the screen they're super cute i gotta clean them off real quick and then i just got these cute necklaces on just for like you know little little zest and then i got like on this cute little anklet i haven't worn anklets in forever but yes this is a vibe so I'm about to hurry up because the place closes at two. They're only there for a couple hours and it's in Racine. So, and then I got to get Sean. So I'm about to head out and we finna go. What up y'all ladies? Make sure y'all I'm with Sean. <laughs> He's taking over the vlog. Cause I gotta show you all my bags. They so cute. They are, they're really cute. Um, I did have black, but it's all sold out. The rest of these finna be sold out too, but my next Them order- the only ones you got left? Yeah, I don't got two more white ones at the studio, but these the only colors that I got left. So make sure y'all get your little bags for and me. He got more stuff coming in y'all. Make Many sure y'all follow him. I'm gonna put his Instagram on the screen. Okay, so make and sure y'all me. ASAP. It be in your P.O. box, your mailbox the next day, the next week, or whatever you want to say. This seatbelt is tight. I don't wear seatbelts, but I had to get on, put the seatbelt on just for the vlog. But, um. Yeah, because they'll be on your ass. Okay, y'all, so, what the fuck? Why is it zoomed in like that? I don't know. You did that. But, yeah, y'all, so we finna go get our tacos. You really was actually supposed to drive, but it's all right. Cause we, I hate driving y'all I just hate it I would rather be chauffeured all my life Okay But I hope these tacos are good I hope we make it okay. So, <laughs> so y'all So unfortunately I checked the Taco Trucks Facebook And um, They said that they were out of state Tacos and I was so Devastated they said they've been busy all day and that was an hour ago so whatever so we're just gonna take pics some instagram photos down here downtown and yeah this is what instagram people do look for locations and it's so nice out today y'all i love it okay y'all it's just 
We just got done taking Instagram photos. What we gonna see in the car? Y'all, if you are taking Instagram photos, don't rush the process. It's all trial and error. Cause you know, you gotta get the perfect lighting, especially when you're outside. Um, people always think I take my pictures on like a professional camera or something to get them extra clear. No, I make sure I have good lighting. And yeah, <laughs> somebody come get this child. I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. I'm about to attempt to Just sell up. these in the mall. I really have faith in him. We can do it. They some cute bags, so we gonna see what it do. I got faith in you. I swear. I know you do. I'm hungry. This mall is dead as fuck. I can't even deal. We didn't even go see a Bath and Body Works. Oh, no, it's more of a low as And we still only we got bags on hand. So. <laughs> We need to get rid of the motherfucking bags. So you need to go to the food court. Okay. Work your magic. What's the bag that you got on the Mighty Denzi? No. You need one of these. Don't say that. That's rude. Say, um, hey, I got Ooh. these bags. Are you interested in okay. one? Okay, I'm gonna say that. Hey, are you interested in buying a bag? It will go cute with your outfit. It'll go. Yeah, say something like that. Okay. After quarantine, be like, ain't shit open. What was the point? This is just somewhere to go, to be honest with you. We just got in the car, you know, got a hand sanitizer. I don't deserve hand sanitizer. Oh, you do. Hold on. <laughs> oh, I thought you had your own. Hey, so and it's some right there, too. Oh, that's hand sanitizer? Mm-hmm. A cute one from Target. Go mm -hmm. ahead and get you some. But yeah, y'all. So, Sean, unfortunately, didn't sell his bags. Mm -hmm. He needs to come down with the price. You know, it's... You know, we're going through a tough time right now, Sean. <laughs> See, so am I. So... <laughs> So, uh, yeah, you gotta plug the girls. So, but there's always tomorrow. Always. It's always tonight, too. I'm <laughs> take them bags. Uh, so, bonfire. So, I'm about to get some desserts from Portillo's and go to eat my brats. And, yeah, turn on some fire shit. Let me see what your playlist looking like. Let me see if it's giving. Hey. Her fantasize having sex with one of your straight friends. Boy or girl? Uh, girl. Mm. Yeah, Sean is bi. <laughs> he be fucking on bitches and niggas. I can't even talk on this damn thing now. Why? Huh? Why? Because I can't. They don't even know all my business. Sean, but it's we okay. Tell T over here is going to be okay. I got too much tea to speak with. They want to kill me. Oh my <laughs> god. Oh my god. I'm really upset we didn't get to go get our tacos. Let me, they didn't even update shit. And I replied on their comment. And they haven't even responded. But um, y'all, we just tried to sell a <laughs> Sean purses to in the drive-through. Like, I'm a fan of blue. Mm. I really want you to let them go today. We gonna have to go to the ghetto. Let's go to a grocery. I mean, the hood store real quick. Okay, we can look. Look, you mm. might see. I'm thin, and they be there. Not influencer the shops. You really got me tight. <laughs> Dead as fuck. Cause the house be, I mean, oh shit. I'm so fucking dead. Y'all, I mean, I I do pay Sean to take my pictures. Right. Like, I would never, I'm gonna cash up him. But if he don't take my picture right, I'm not paying him. She not gonna pay me. I'm not paying him. If it don't get uploaded, I don't get paid. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, this dang. Is small? Right, it's like yeah, a medium. Wow. These I wonder what the medium small, look like. Right. Everything big around. Can I get a straw? 
Yeah, the straw's in the bag. Oh, okay. okay. Thank, Thank you. you. But, um, yeah, girl. So, I guess y'all can book Sean for an influencer. Y'all can book me for everything. Sean is just out here trying to get it, okay? We gotta respect the hustle. Um, find a straw. Shout out to Kyra for my skin. I can't wait to see drop this. Um, we gonna get his skin together. Well, it's it it's looks so much better than what, what it was. was. Bitch, I ain't no. Oh, ain't even no straw in here. Why is she capping? They usually put straws in the bag. Oh, they did it. Thank you. Oh, well, I am rich. All right, to the crib we go. Do you want to go to the beauty supply? Oh, the beauty supply. I mean, not the beauty supply. But the ghetto. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you just need to give them away for thirty. I am. Twenty-five dollars. Oh hell no, not twenty-five. That's I need more than a hundred dollars off them bags. I'm okay. Twenty-five. I know I gotta keep my money on go. Got that ass to the home now my neighbors having a party and shit but um yeah y'all so i'm just gonna end this vlog off here it was fun it was a good weekend now tomorrow's a memorial day i don't know what i have planned maybe i'll vlog i don't know so yeah more vlogs to come of course and also i was just looking through my comments and i um posted a girl chat the other day and somebody was like you should do like a little segment where people dm you like scenarios and like you give advice in a video or something like that so let me know if you'll be interested in that i was kind of thinking of doing that like y'all would do say what y'all going through or whatever some type of scenario and i would be like this is what i would do so yeah let me know if you're interested in that and skincare routine coming soon i just got a bunch of videos that i gotta do um i'm trying to get organized with my channel i'm trying to have like an actual date where i upload and time i already know what time i want to upload because i just um if you're an influencer i looked at a um a video last night where they were like um how to boost your channel and stuff like that so um, and just because your channel is successful does not mean that you stop learning how to do something like There's no limit to what you want to learn. You know what I'm saying? So it's a vid IQ Um, so basically they tell me what time I should upload So I got that down. I just got to come up with days. I will want to upload So Yeah, so let me know what days I should upload Anyways, y'all, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I love y'all so much, and I'm going to see y'all next video. Bye.